Good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Welcome back to the beginner tutorial series that I'm doing, basically helping beginners to wax, walk through the, the initial steps and help you get started with wax on, on the right way. Today's tutorial is going to be about how to sell NFTs on the Atomic Hub market. Uh, basically, you have, uh, whether you were able to earn some NFTs or you bought some NFTs that you no longer want, this is the easy way to, on how to sell those on the Atomic Hub. So let's go ahead over to there. Um, in order to get Atomic Hub, you go to wax.atomichub.io. I'll have the link in this description down below. This is the first screen that you're going to see. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over to your wallet and show the NFTs that you have in your wallet. So you're going to go up here to the top right, select that pull down, and you're going to go to my inventory. Click on that, and it's going to show you all the NFTs that you currently have in your inventory. Depending on how many you have, it may be easy. You can just scroll down and select. Or if you have a lot of NFTs, you may want to go ahead and pick the project that you're going to go from. So you you click on this menu here and you go to the project. We're going to go ahead and list a Krypton um, one. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Krypton. And you're going to see all the NFTs that you have for that specific project. I uh, load more and you can go through that whole process. What we are going to do on today's video is sell. Let's go ahead and sell one of these guys right here. Um, what you do is you can scroll over it and you can see that the lowest price um, or you can just go down here and click list on market so you click on that and it's going to show you this it shows you the lowest market listing shows you your price that you paid ignore that it was a lot <laughs> uh, it shows you the suge suggested price depending on how fast you want to sell your nft you can always undercut the lowest price which i'm going to do on this one so i'm going to go 5.48 you can only go two digits, two decimal points over. So I can't go if I'm nine, it'll just go over to the, the four eight. Um, then what you do is you simply go down and you click on confirm. If it's a higher price NFT and you wanna do either the suggested or you wanna do basically put a limit on how it's, for example, I wanted to sell this at 10 and I'm okay with it sitting there a while, I'll go ahead and put 10 in there. You also have the choice of switching over to USD, which basically, uh, it's basically the, the 52 cents here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep it on wax. I'm gonna sell this for 5.48 and you click confirm and it's that simple. That's how you list something. You And then you'll get this transaction is successful. If for some reason you don't get this, you get a red marker. You may need to bump up your RAM. You may need to try again. But in order to check whether you listed it correctly, you go back up to here, which is the menu on the top right, do the drop down and you go to my listings. If I click on that, it's going to show me all of the items that I currently have list, listed on the, on the secondary market. This is the one I just posted. Um, what I can do is I can just double check the price. I can edit the price. I can go in here. It shows my current price. So say I'm going to bump this down by a little bit just to make sure it's the lowest. You change the price, you go to confirm, and there you go. It is, it's, it updates. You need to refresh. That's, it does, oh, there we go. It actually, up. sometimes you need to refresh. Sometimes you, it automatically does it like it did there. All right. The other question that I get all the time is I, I, my, my wax just went up. I had a whole bunch of things listed. How do I know what I sold? That's a really easy. If you're in the same menu, you scroll up just a little bit, you'll see these top menus up here. Just click on sold and it'll show you the the last list of things that you have sold on the secondary market it shows you what you sold it for it shows you your wallet you show who you sold it to and the date you sold it at so that's a really easy way to see what you're selling um, quickly put list a few things and if you want to cancel something that you're selling you can either go to my listings uh, this is where it shows all the sold items and go to edit and select cancel and that'll cancel the sale or you can go ahead over to my inventory uh, and just select the button to cancel listing that's how you cancel the sales i hope this was very helpful for you i'm going to continue to put more tutorials out there to try and help beginners really get accustomed to to wax and start on the right foot so i hope you all have a fantastic day and i'll talk to you later bye